Hello everyone, this is the Hunter Collector with another action figure review. And here we have the 60th anniversary Spider-Man um, pack, Iron Spider. This is the first uh, figure that I got that has this non-plastic uh, covering over the figure, which I'm not a big fan of just because people could swap figures. I'm not a big fan of that. Uh, but I like the idea though. Um, but yeah, this is the first time I ever gotten one of these guys. Uh, to review. Uh, I found it at Target today, so I'm happy about this. Um, but yeah, let's go over to the box. So first we get this nice look of the figure right up front with the Iron Spider in the back and the blue. We have this like comic uh, polka dot um, black dots going on in there. And then we get the Marvel Spider-Man logo there, Iron Spider. A uh, picture of the Iron Spider logo in its um, straight up form uh, pose. And then the side, uh, we get a picture of Iron Spider from the comics, Marvel Legends logo here. Top, we get the Spider-Man 60 Amazing Years. Uh, and then also in the corner here, we get that picture of Spider-Man, like the Steve Ditko look. And then Marvel Legends logo here in the corner. Here is the back of the, here's what the figure is supposed to look like. And we also got, shows off the accessories for it, uh, which is Swooping Hands. And then we got Marvel Legends logo here in the corner. We get the um, UPC right there and all this junk right here. But besides that, let's crack them open. And here is Iron Spider out of the package. So first, let's go over the accessories. So first, we got two whipping hands, which we've seen this mold before. It's just painted in a shiny red here, which I like. And then we got three of these Iron Spider legs, which we've never seen before. These are pretty cool, actually. So yeah, you get the little peg here. You get these like little joint pieces here. This one doesn't move. This one does. And it kind of just works the same way as the um, the Avengers Infinity War Iron Spider works. So yeah, you get, like, you get to bend this up and down like that. And it also rotates too. And I think it's the same deal. This one doesn't move, this one does though. So only two of the of the four kind of move. This one I don't think rotates though. Yeah, this one doesn't rotate. And then you got this really cool spike right here. But I wish I would do wish this one moved. This one would be pretty cool to have move. But yeah, we get three of those, and these are all the same. So that's what we got for accessories. Here is Iron Spider up close. I really like the head sculpt. The head sculpt looks really cool. You got the gold eyes. You get the red helmet. All around um and then you got like the sculpted upward eyes and then uh it's mainly just like really metallic red cherry metallic red i love this color though it's really nice um and then the gold spider is also sculpted on there too looks really cool and you get this like little back piece for the uh, spiders to go peg in there which is nice nothing else really too much in the back you get these web shooter pieces here. These are not separate, so you cannot take them off or anything like that. You get fisted hands. And then you get these um, like gold ankle parts that he has in the comics here too. And these are actually sculpted upward. And then that's all we got really for looks. Besides that, let's go over to articulation. So he has a disc ball jointed head. Goes down that far, up that far. Left and right movement. Some, not a whole lot of head pivoting, but a decent amount. Soldiers move up that far. 360 rotation there. He also has butterfly joints. Moves a little bit. Um, bicep swivel, double jointed elbows. I almost forgot to say pinless joints for both knees and elbows. Uh, wrist hinge up that far. I mean down that far, up that far. 360 rotation. You got ab crunch. It is very clicky though. And then backward that far. Waist swivel. 360 rot rotation there. Legs kick out that far. I do wish they did do the drop down hips. Kicks up that far. Backwards, not much. Thigh cut, double jointed knees. Like I said, also pinless. I'm a little worried. This 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 part is not really moving. I'll leave it that alone. Uh, yeah, I also got a, a boot cut here, which is nice. And then ankles hinge down that far, up that far. Nice ankle pivot. And then to put in 
the Mac pieces, you just kind of do this. The, oh, yeah, I almost for, forgot to say this part moves, too, for you. But, yeah, you just kind of pop those in like that. So yeah, that is the Iron Spider figure. I really, really love this figure. It looks so cool, and I love the arms on it. Like, it just looks sleek. I love it. And I've also been asking for this figure for a while, too. Like, I know they made it, like, back in, like, 2015 with the old, like, body sculpt and everything. But I love how this one turned out. It's very clean. And I love how the arms are. The only problem that I have with it is that I do wish every single one of these joints do move on the arms. Because I was just kind of, it wasn't that one, but I was pushing down on this one. And that's the one that doesn't have the the joint. So I do wish they did have joints for all of them. But besides that, that was my only problem with it. But the figure itself, it's amazing. Um, but besides that, that's all I got. If you guys want more, like quick rapid fire uh review go ahead and check out my check out my tiktok in the link tree in my description it's the hunter collector um and if you also want to support me on my other platforms check that out as well in the link tree but besides that that's all i got